Hi and welcome to this DCP web tutorial. In today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to install Blender 3D onto Windows 10. So I'm going to open up my web browser and I'm going to go to Google and type in Blender 3D and then I'm going to click on this link up here which is blender.org. So Blender is a powerful 3D animation application. It's free to download and use. It's a quite a technical tool but with some learning and um, gaining some experience it can be a very powerful tool to create 3d based animation and artwork so to download we're going to click on this blue button here download blender 2.79 B the latest version once we click that you'll see that there's different versions here and we're just going to click download blender here and when we click that button blender will start to download here you see So once it's downloaded, depending on your browser, if it's Google Chrome, then it will show down here. If it's Internet Explorer, it might show around here somewhere. And if it's Firefox, there'll be a little download option up here to select the file. Simply click on the file to launch the application. You can see Norton's has checked it and said that it's safe. And then we just need to wait a few seconds for the installation to start. We can minimize this. So here's the screen. I'm just going to click the next button, we'll agree to the license and click next and then we're just going to install it as default. So this may take up to a minute to install depending on the speed of your machine so we'll just be patient and let this install. A screen might pop up, you probably can't see this on my screen and it's just asking to allow Blender to make changes to your Windows computer it just means that it's going to install the software but it's a security procedure so I'll click yes and now you can see the installation is processing Okay, that's all installed. I'm going to click the finish button. If we go to the start menu, we should see Blender here. So I can just open that and then drag and drop it into my tiles here. It says that it's already pinned because I pinned it before. So I can see that here in my applications, here's Blender. I'm just going to launch the application. Let's just make sure it's all working. And here we've got the object. We've got a camera we can rotate around. The camera's up here. And that's it pretty much done let's just try a test render you can see the object's been rendered so it's all working correctly so i hope you find this tutorial useful i'm going to close down blender and show you one more thing if you go to my youtube channel dcp web designers so just type in dcp web designers into google uh, youtube search and then click on playlist here you see playlist right here and if you scroll down to the bottom you'll see blender 3d animation tutorial so there's seven parts to this tutorial, but it will allow you to create a 3D animated logo. It's quite a good tutorial if you're a beginner and you've never used Blender. This will really teach you some key, key uh, shortcuts and tools and just give you a good understanding of how Blender works. So do go through that tutorial if you get the time and that will help you to understand Blender. Okay, I hope you find this tutorial useful and I look forward to seeing you on the next DCP web tutorial.